The latest version of Roland's Phantom Synth Workstation is a brand new, more direct interface. New sound engines and lots of connectivity or integration to bring things up to date. We're looking at the 88 Note Phantom 8 here, but you can also buy the Phantom 7 and Phantom 6, which have 76 and 61 keys respectively. The new Phantom platform uses Roland's latest and core tech with processing headroom for future engine upgrades and additions. The way the Phantom operates now revolves around scenes. A scene is much like the old live set and is basically a container or snapshot of everything on the front panel. One scene can be made up of up to 16 zones. Each zone then contains a tone. Each partial within a tone can contain a completely different sound engine, including the model V piano engine, PCM, VA modeling. So there's a lot on offer. PCM banks and NB contain 963 and 257 samples respectively, giving a total of 1,220 raw partial waves to build on across the four partials available within a tone. To bring things further up to date, you'll also find new tones from the AX Edge Keter, alongside classics from the Integra 7 and Roman 15 5080, though there are none of the lovely supernatural acoustic tones on board. Regarding hands-on control, there's the standard issue Roland Mod or Bender, Several assignable switches, two wheels plus eight faders with LED level and LED ring dials for each of the 16 zones, plus one fader for USB audio streaming level from your DAW. There are six high-resolution clickable knobs for editing under the screen, then you also get direct oscillator, filter, envelope, and effect controls right on the front panel, which take you directly to the main areas of a sound you'd most likely want to edit on the fly. Roland has done a great job keeping things simple but effective, especially considering the power under the hood. In addition, there are 16 TR8 style step buttons for step sequencing, which also take you directly to the 16 instrument categories and a rhythm track which allows you to change drum patterns or sync them to the sequencer and then easily switch between each section and pattern on screen. Finally, you have 16 pads and these can be used for triggering notes, samples, audio, MIDI, sequences, and more besides. The Phantom 8 has a high-quality, great-feeling wooden PHA-50 key, but with aftertouch. All the new Phantoms feel and look the part, and are built solidly throughout, with a metal front panel and under-key lip, plastic for the rear, sides and controllers panel, and what appears to be a particle board base. Switches feel positive, knobs and dials are smooth and high-resolution, panel lighting is great for navigating and viewing stored values of knobs and the new large color touchscreen is the snappiest I've used in a workstation. In fact, Roland has come up with the most intuitive workstation UI and UX design we've laid hands on today. You can get at everything directly from the front panel yet. Even when you dig deep, the Phantom never gets overwhelming. Plus, all the lettering on screen is of a size that can actually be read comfortably.